One of the first things that we recommend that you do when your display isn't working properly is to do a factory reset on the display. Now for this demonstration, we're going to be using a Matco SBL4, but it's important to note that the steps that I'm about to show you will work on all Matco displays. The first step is actually to pull off the side panel. Looking at the side of the communication board, you can see that there's four buttons, left, right, learn, and reset. In order to perform the factory default on a display, you need to press and let go of the reset button. The display is going to start counting down. While it's counting down, you want to hold in left and right at the same time. And just keep those two buttons held in until the countdown starts a second time. So let me demonstrate right now. You just learned how to do a factory reset on a Matco remote display. I hope that you learned something while watching this video and feel free to check out some of our other videos to learn more about Matco remote displays.